the gentle rolling hills of Dunscore. This idyllic rural community near Dumfries in the south of Scotland was where Jane Haining grew up. The brave and selfless Church of Scotland missionary was a shining light in the darkness of the Second World War. She was a matron of the Scottish Missions Girls Boarding School in Budapest in Hungary and looked after Christian and Jewish girls. In her eyes they were children of God and she treated them equally. And for this Miss Haining paid the ultimate price. She was arrested and taken to the Auschwitz-Birkenau extermination camp where she died in 1944. Now, 73 years after her death, the Holocaust Memorial Centre in Budapest is putting on an exhibition for the first time to celebrate her extraordinary life. Centre officials Zoltan Toth Heinemann and Dr Gabor McLarry visited Dunscore Parish Church on a fact-finding mission to seek inspiration. Heining was a very important figure of the Holocaust history in Budapest. Not just very important, but a unique figure, because all the other players during the Holocaust, rescuers or victims or perpetrators, they were local people. Jane Henning had the, was the only one who had the chance to choose to stay there, to risk her life, to save children, or to just leave and come back to Britain. Actually, we are planning to display an exhibition on uh, Jane Haining this autumn in order to keep up her memory, in order to share her uh, great story. So we came here to Scotland to get the inspiration. Actually, primarily focusing on education of young generations, education to learn that sometimes it's important to make sacrifice. The story of Jane Haining and her self-sacrifice in staying in Budapest and helping young Jewish children is a story which is important for young Scottish people to learn about and it's one that I teach in school to my third year pupils. I'm just back from an annual teacher training programme run through the Holocaust Educational Trust at Yad Vashem in Jerusalem and was privileged to see Jane Haring's name in the Garden of Remembrance there. in Dunscore, the village that Jane Hinning was raised in and it breaks my heart when I look around and I see this beautiful part of Scotland where she grew up and how she ended her days in the hellhole that was Auschwitz. <laughs> <laughs>